chestnut. Congratulations! You're opening your own restaurant today. Chestnut restaurant. Congratulations! Soon! Soon! Good luck! So what are you making today? I'm making a bolognese lasagna. Uh, is it Italian? I'm uh, pretty sure. How many eggs? I will add the recipe in, in details. No, I I thought you were supposed to mix it together with your hands. Started with the fork first. Uh, oh, the instructions? Yeah. Uh -huh. I read an instruction. Oh, good. <laughs> That's why you're the boss. I'm a boss. Bessamel. 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 Not Bessamel. Bessamel mucho. Turn on the gas. The more the better, so it doesn't matter. The more butter, the more better. Okay. <laughs> Overheated. No, that's right. Absolutely. Okay, almost done. And just flour. Mm -hmm. Regular flour, the semolina type. Okay. That's a Korean writing, so for uh, viewers or viewer who doesn't. Viewer? <laughs> 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 hey, it gives me a million viewers are watching this oh, yes, video. Yes. Uh, so for our viewers at home, what, what does this say? It says organic. Yeah. <laughs> but, Yuginong is organic. Yeah. Milkaru is flour. All right. What are you looking for? Nutmeg. Oh, nutmeg. Why don't you show us what it looks like? The cinnamon. That cinnamon. <laughs> well, it just got in there. Okay. This is this called is nutmeg. nutmeg. Okay. Can you show it a slow motion? Just... Slow motion, motion you kind of okay, okay. just you know. Ooh. So what's the little metal thing in there? Uh, this is a kind of grinder. Okay. So I will grind the. Okay, you sound there. really weird right now. Okay. 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 It's a little grinder. Okay. Pinch of the max. Pinch. Yeah. <laughs> Looks good. Okay. Oh. Cinnamon. Don't a little bit of a salt. I think you should probably measure in your hand to show us how much you're putting in there. Okay. You're never gonna know how much salt is going uh, in there. Okay. <laughs> That's my problem. Yeah. Let's okay. try. And five hundred milliliters milk. You spoiled. I failed. You failed already? Yeah. Okay. All right. I, I'm not sure. Well, I want to see how it goes. Yeah. Oh. I think I think all of our viewers are going to be curious how it turns out, mm -hmm. uh, including me. When are you boiling it? I don't know. We're not boiling. Twenty minutes. Twenty minutes? Yeah. Okay. So you boil over. It looks like high heat, and stir. You can stir continuously. I'm not going to stand here for twenty minutes. I poured too much milk before, so I will make roux. I will mix with the uh, big pot. We need a carrot and onion. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, that's two carrots. Yeah. And that onion looks like a very big a box for some little kid's jewelry. No, what's in there? This is the onion. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Conveniently already chopped up? No, I didn't. It's the leftover. Somebody's going on down here. Let's see. Um, is that your dog? He's the owner of this restaurant. Mm. Well, he likes the sound of cutting the carrots for some reason. Oh. Okay. Oh, you're making French fries. Chop, 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 chop. Oh, what do you call it? Minimal, <laughs> minimal life. So I have only one wooden spoon. I always do this. Yes. Minimalism. Yeah, minimalism. Mm -hmm. So I wondered where the other wooden spoons went. Yeah. I thought that was a pretty. Mm -hmm. I'll just have to go buy more. I didn't tell a roommate. I'm gonna throw in some pepper. Okay. 
and salt. Oh yeah, that much. Okay, so we have some beef here. It looks like Aussie beef. Yeah. And the price? Almost 400 grams and seven dollars. Seven dollars yeah. approximately. It's yeah. a six thousand one. Should have gone out in Korea. And the onions are cooked down nice. They look kind of clear, mm -hmm. caramelized almost. I don't think it's caramelized. I don't know. <laughs> it just it just looks creamy. Just the fried onions. Just fried. No sugar is added here, people. Just calm down. She doesn't like to fail, ladies and gentlemen. Keep your fingers crossed. Oh. One of them was salty. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I remember it was so salty. We tried to avoid eating it, but oh. not to waste it. Like, we'll just choke it down. Choke it down. Choke it down. And now for the 100 milliliters white wine. Ooh. So I'll make double, so. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Look at this right. Yeah, whatever. Just not hey, it doesn't matter. You didn't measure anything else. Why no. do you have to measure the wine? <laughs> do you want me to use my palm? Yeah. Ooh. You need to evaporate the mm. wine. Mm. That's a bit old. Okay. Oh, it smells really good. Yeah. It smells like boiling wine. Tomato puree. Oh, well, this is Hans sauce. This is an American brand, but where did you get this from? The grocery store? Yo, I got this at Ross. You got it at Ross? Ross. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> so it looks like. Ah. Looks like you, you got the, the lid in there. You need a magnet to get that out. Mm -hmm. or, or use the spoon. I don't understand why do they make the can this way. There's the boss. He's keeping an eye on you. So you're using this all-purpose flour. Yeah. Um, so it doesn't stick to the pasta maker. Mm -hmm. What about the shaker? Is this one of those like fifty dollar shakers? No, that's just I couldn't afford it. It's just a few dollars. I got this at IKEA. Not at Raw. Here it is. This little indicator over here shows zero. Our boss is eating the crumbs off the floor. But uh yeah. chop it up. Cut into half. Okay. So now you're able to almost see through it. Let's take a look see at that. through. It's like the pizza. Here's the recipe for today's dish, lasagna bolognese. And here are the instructions. So not very detailed. I like this part. <laughs> for a few minutes. Okay. Occasionally. So it's uh, not exact. Kind of like your recipes. Just throw some salt and pepper in there. Okay, so what are you doing now? You're going over to the boiling water? Okay, follow the dough mittens. Oh, oh it's boiling. First, okay, the fire. Is that a wet towel? Yeah. Keep okay. towel. And you put some salt in the water, I guess. She's going in. Okay. All right, and what you use in there for a stirring? Are they plastic chopsticks with silicone. spoons on the end? Silicone. All right. Okay, okay. and. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Why didn't I throw the spoon away? I know. Minimalism. You mm -hmm. throw away the things you need. Mm -hmm. Keep the things you don't need. I think we're doing it wrong. <laughs> All right. So. We're keeping it on a damp towel in order to keep it from sticking. 
I hope these sheets are sheets. Sheets. Hmm. Your pronunciation's fine. Sheets. Sheets. Hmm. They're huge. So we have some of this fresh cheese. And what's the type of the cheese? Parmesan. Okay, Parmesan wedge. Gotcha. So you can use a Parmesan mediano or you can use just Parmesan. This is like a little piece of cheese, right? Yeah. Or is this pasta? Mm -hmm. It's cheese? Cheese. Uh, we gotta check, make sure it's okay. Wow. Tastes like cheese. Oh, it's kind of salty. Cheese? Yeah. Okay. Some fresh butter. Okay. Oh, I cut perfectly. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the small things in life that make you happy, isn't it? This is the flour, butter, and salt. Now it looks like it's kind of uh, mm, a little bit mixing together. Yeah, so I, 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 I don't happens. understand why the cookbook says I have to make two layers. Oh, can't I mix together? Oh, I this think it's probably better if you just follow the direction. Okay, I think it's done. Okay. And and cheese. Uh -huh. So each layer is four ingredients basically. Mm -hmm. Another sheet. Oh ho ho! Look at that. Like a glove. I know a lot of people they make lasagna using a ricotta cheese mm -hmm. and uh, you know that's a reasonable alternative mm. but this taste is so much nicer mm -hmm. and uh, very creamy watching carefully mr. chestnut your uh, first kitchen video mm. you can't see a thing actually you can only see our butts and the side of the cabinet like that dog's view what is dog's view? Let's find out. Can't see anything. Oh. Okay. So, so I'm just patching. So putting some. Yeah. Putting some smaller pieces. Uh -huh. Okay. To cover up. Yep. Doesn't right. matter. It doesn't matter. That's the moral of the story today, kids. The awkwardness of holding this camera next to your face. Mm. Do you feel a little bit pressured by that? Yeah, absolutely. From the beginning. Literally touching your face. Is mm. a, I don't know what else to do. She's a nice a sauce. Okay. I'll put the third layer of Parmesan. Okay, here it comes. I'm gonna open it up here. Ooh. Wow, it's quite impressive. Oh. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Mm. It's oil from the cheese and the butter and the beef in half, I suppose. Okay, so what we see here is some besame sauce and uh, mixed with the Parmesan coming up through. Oh, looks great. Side view. Beautiful. All right. It's going to be my piece. Whoa. Topping looks really nice. A lot of crispy on the edges here. Really good. Really delicious, crispy things. Over here. And we have here. The creamy besame sauce really makes the meat and fillings very creamy. Okay, check it out, people. 
Look at that. Feast your eye. Oh, it's another piece. So far, half is gone. <laughs> and we have a ginking dog over here. Ginka! Hey, Bada! Super annoying, but cute nonetheless. Okay, boss. What do you think of this lasagna? Is it okay? Mmm. Says it's good. I cooked for you. What is this? This is lasagna. <laughs> this is lasagna. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, that's nice.